Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Um, Happy New Year. It's very hard to believe that another year has passed. Um, this is Seattle saying hi. But anyway, some new things. I cut these little badongity doos for myself. Um, and I also got my ears pierced. Yes, beautiful. Are going to be building the nest boxes today. We have a little helper in there. Hi. Tinkerbell. So she's probably gonna lay an egg. Look at this lovely cleaned out chicken coop. There's still poop in there. Oh, please tell me if this is capturing. I don't know if you guys can see this right here, but the smoke against the sunlight. I'm sure chickens have a hissing sound just like many other animals. You don't like the drill, do you? Guys, so it is the next day. Um, but this is what me and my dad got done on the chicken coop um, yesterday from old pallet wood that we picked up at an old book company that my dad used to work at. Um, but let me open up this door so you can see. All right, here we go. Right in there is where the nest boxes are gonna be. Um, cleared out all the hay, um, but we haven't quite finished it just yet. Um, yesterday we kind of ran out of time but yeah today or tomorrow i think we're going to start the nest boxes there's going to be three of them and seattle has come over to say hi haven't you buddy what did you get what did you get z um i got a caramel iced coffee and the caramel running down is so pretty it is very pretty isn't it yeah and mom you didn't get anything no i didn't now I made some more of my homemade uh, healthy banana muffins with Stripey the banana because of the stripe on it that I just smashed. Okay everybody, so it is later in the day as you can probably tell. And it just so happens that the chickens just ran out of feed. Like in their container, not like actually like run out of feed that we have. So yesterday we bought a bag of pellets because um, recently, or like ever since they were babies, we have been giving them chick starter grower, which is like little crumbled up pellets. So yesterday we got a big bag of pellets and I didn't read the labels correctly. Um, and it turns out that the pellets were just for meat chickens. However, they are fine for egg laying chickens if mixed with like, uh, feed that's for egg layers. So right now I'm going to go start mixing it up. Also, why we have switched from crumble to pellets is you're supposed to do that when, um, you're supposed to do that once they get close to laying eggs or start laying eggs, which we're very close to both, so, yeah. Okay, so here we have this five gallon bucket that I'm going to be mixing the feed in, and I'm gonna show you what feeds we're mixing. So these are the pellets that we got. Doomer is our main brand. Um, this is the scratch, the main scratch that I give them. Um, that I'm going to be mixing. That's, this is the main thing I'm mixing with it. And then we have the chick starter grower that we usually give them, um, but that I'm also going to be mixing with this.
just to show you guys. This is the crumble that the chickens have been eating. And these are the pellets that they are now going to eat, so. So you guys might have um, been hearing me refer to Lily. That is Lily, the stray, um, who looks exactly like Freddy. Um, she just showed up a while ago and she hasn't left yet. So yeah. Anyway, you can see how uncanny it is, how they look so much like each other. I'm Fred is scared though. And Finley and Lily have become best friends, as you can see. Fred! They seem to really enjoy it. <laughs> They're being pigs, so I guess that means they enjoy it. Really hope that that saw does not accidentally turn on. Jomo and Finley up there, or up there. Freddy's trying to figure out how to get up. Just having some alone time, Finn. Are the kids too much? Are they just too much? Yes, they are. Oh, you're so sweet when you wanna be. <laughs> Yes, you are. So I have the ugly flash on out here because it is nighttime. But I just want to show you this fort that William and Gianna and I made. So we have palm fronds up there for the roof. And we found this spot in the woods that we made it in between, I think, three trees. Correction fort. There's a little window right out here. And this is the walls. Apparently that's a doormat of palm fronds. Come right here. Viana did a bunch of these hanging things. And it's so cute. Then we have this over here. We this have is, psychics. This is a stove that William expertly made out of bricks. Can you show them the bacon? And we are cooking bacon. cooking bacon, and it's sizzling. I'll give you a full tour of the stove that. later. There's the fire in there, and then up here, through the brick holes, the flame can come through and heat up the pot, or I mean the skillet, the mini skillet. We're, we're frying, test frying a piece of bacon. It's and sizzling. It's so cool. Okay guys, so I am like ecstatic right now, so pardon me if I sound way too excited at the moment. So I was just like, I've been coming out to check the coop for like, for the past week, like three times a day just to look for eggs. Um, and I just, I just came out and looked. So like about two hours ago, I came out and looked and there was nothing. And I just came out and looked like two minutes ago and you will not believe what is in here? Does anyone see what is right there? That is an egg. That is seriously an egg. I have been waiting for so long. You do not even know. It's been like four months. And I oh. Okay, okay, I need, I need to calm down. But yeah, anyways, so we got an egg today. It's just, just a little tiny egg. Just a little tiny egg. I think it was a cinnamon queen egg. I'm not sure. But that, that is insane. Like, oh. Freddy, what do you have? Well, today is just full of surprises. Did you catch your first something? Can you turn around so I can see? Fred. Oh, it's still alive? Oh, Fred! 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 Get it! Get it, please! Please! Just kill it! Put it out of its misery already! Ew! 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 
Okay, so it is two days later, and we've just now finished the nest boxes, but we have two hens nesting in them at the moment, and I don't really want to disturb them in case they're um, trying to lay eggs. So if they come out, I will show you guys. So you guys, here are the nest boxes. Um, my dad made them so that, like, if we move or something, they can be, like, something separate. Um, so that we can, so he just made them so that we can set them in here and make them mobile. Um, but yeah, here's the one that was being nested in quite a bit. Um, but yeah, that, those are the nest boxes. Attracted an audience there and there. Guys, I need personal space, you know. Lily! Lily! Good grief! Sounds like, okay, bye! So guys, we just got finished with Sunday lunch and I went out to check and see if there was any eggs and guess what we got? This one right here is the first one that we got. And we have a little second one. Is it so cute? It's a lot, a lot smaller than the first one, but it's still an egg. Cool picture. Oh. <laughs> so the other heads are like, oh, what a joy. Like, here comes Holly. Oh, shoot. I missed it. Oh, can you see? I'm not sure. Franny is right there. She was right there on that big sick line right here. I don't know where she's going or what she's doing or if she's trying to die, but that's what we're working with at the moment. Chickens are having fights over there. She's trying to reach the moon, I think, to be honest. Can y'all see her now? Franny. You're gonna go. Okay, rescue operation. Show Franny. Franny here. This luck help. Down. It's okay, Fran. Help's on the way. Come on. Come on, Fran. Jump. Jump, Fran. Thank okay, you. okay. There is Franny. She is currently somehow, I don't know if she has a death wish or something. But um, we are trying to save her. Well, Chloe is trying to save her. Um, and she's just not responding. Franny, we get to a point of helping her and she just leaves. She is. Love to see it. Love it. Seattle, don't suffocate her. Hey, good morning everyone. So it is day two of trying to catch an egg being laid on camera. Um, we have Oslo in the nest box right now. She's only laid one egg so far and that was day before yesterday. Um, so yeah, I'm going to see if I can catch her laying an egg. There she is. Also, um, in case you're wondering, I put my hair in lovely braids um, for this weekend because my friend is going to be coming over for a sleepover and I want a, um, hey, stop trying to escape. I want curly hair. So, yeah, it took me about two hours to get, like, 10 braids in my hair. So, yeah. Come on, Oslo. I'm waiting for it. Travel is being annoying because she's pecking at the wire trying to get out, but the hens aren't allowed out until they've laid their eggs because we don't want eggs being laid in the woods. And she's not too happy about it. She has gotten up and is now fixing the nest box to her liking. Red butt. Yeah, you're nodding at me, aren't you? 
Come here. Come here. No, don't go on the roof. Don't go on the roof. Don't go on the roof. All right, well, I'm sort of losing hope. So I think we are gonna call it. I think we're gonna call it a day and just let Oslo lay her egg in peace and come out here and try to get it. All right, never mind, I changed my mind. I went inside, bundled up, and got me some coffee because no morning is complete without coffee. So if you guys haven't noticed already, all of the hens chose one nest box to lay all their eggs in. And this morning, Oslo got the first pick and all of the other hens like to pick on her because she is Seattle's favorite and they are jealous of that role so that they pick on her. And they are mad this morning because she got the first choice at the nest box and they don't like to use the other two nest boxes. So right now I'll show you what's happening. I don't know if you guys can see, but Truffle, the cinnamon that is in the nest box with Oslo is dead set on laying her eggs in there, her egg in there. I just, I wish they would just have patience and or use just use the other nest boxes that we worked very hard to build but no i just want to check if she laid an egg while i was gone and she's just hiding it now <laughs> oh okay 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 okay, okay. I am so sorry, Oslo. All right, well, Oslo just got up and left, so there went that, but um, the cinnamons are very eager to take over her nest box. <laughs> Guys, Truffle, just leave her alone. Just let her lay her egg. No, don't escape. Huh. I didn't catch it on camera, unfortunately. But there's a fresh egg. It's like wet. Oslo, chill. <laughs> Seattle is now very flustered because his wife is flustered. I feel like I'm gonna have to yell for you to hear me. Oh, never mind. They're done. You missed like 10 minutes. Never mind, they're not done. But you missed like 10 minutes of them doing that. All right, well, Oslo is dead set on not letting me get that egg. I just got brutally pecked in the hand when I tried to get it. So, um, yeah, that was that. Um, I think I'm gonna end off this video here because it's getting a bit long because you guys got two weeks of footage since, since I forgot to post or like I wasn't ready to post. So, Oslo wants to help out in the outro but yeah thanks so much for watching and if you did enjoy please be sure to like and subscribe for more fun adventures like this on finding um eggs in nest boxes and hand fighting and all that good stuff so yeah um i will see you guys next week bye